Hey guys, me Dave. It's uh, 10 1 October, October 1st. Um, so I thought I'd do a little video. Not much going on. I'm gonna, it, I'll probably keep this pretty short. Um, not much going on. Um, I've been getting hit all day. Um, I thought they, they were going to lay off me after I got up and stuff, but they didn't. Um, it's been going on all day, on and off. Um, you know, hitting me with uh, microwaves to the head, make my balance feel off and stuff like that. And um, just being jerks, basically, all day today, about 12 hours from 8 in the morning till 8 at night. And then they kind of laid off me a little bit now um, and stuff. But, um, um, you know, hey, I guess it was coming. You know, they gave me a couple weeks off and now it's... Um, it, it came today, so, anyway, I'm getting excited, not, not about targeting, <laughs> you know, so I'm getting excited, um, about, uh, there's some, some things I want to do this month, I get paid tomorrow, and, uh, I want to, um, do some smoking, I'm gonna do as, uh, a couple, uh, uh, full, full chickens, you know, whole chickens on the smoker. Um, do that this month. Um, I'm going to try to go camping maybe twice this month. Um, we are in winter rates now. It's the off season. So, uh, you know, um, the, uh, the campsite's only for electric. It's only 26 bucks for electric. But they charge you $7 to book it online. You know, so it's... What, 33 bucks um which still isn't too bad you know 30 33 bucks a night um so we're gonna try to go camping well we're i think we're gonna go monday um the site we like is open so i think we're gonna go monday and um i'm gonna book it tomorrow and uh and then i uh i'm gonna order some wood chips uh for the smoker uh, I found on Amazon, pretty cheap, two pound bags, uh, there's like five of them for 20 bucks, you know, so we're getting, we got apple, hickory, and, uh, oh, I don't know what other ones, apple, hickory, and, uh, maple, and, you know, there's, uh, there's other, uh, other kinds of wood, involved, you know, uh, cherry, um, and stuff, so we're gonna smoke, we're gonna smoke some food this month, uh, use my smoker, and, um, do that so got to do that you gotta you know you know what I mean you know what I'm saying you guys you know you gotta try to break this stuff up a little bit you know you get hit and then you try to you know you try to do something to break it up try to go camping if you get a break and all this stuff am I gonna be able to go camping I don't know you know are they gonna nail me they might nail me up until I leave to go camping we'll just have to wait and see you know it's just it's so hard to tell with these guys um but that's what we're going to do. We're going to try to have a little fun this month before it gets too cold and before the snow comes. Um, we're going to try to do some winter camping this year. Um, we found a campground about 20 minutes away. It's a state campground, and they're open all year round. So we're going to try to do some winter camping this year. Um, you know, if it's 20 and above, you know, um, we don't want to get... Uh, you know, where it's so cold, it's miserable to go. You know what I mean? So we're going to do some winter camping. We got, uh, you know, you try to, you know, you're being targeted, and these guys torture you. You know, I mean, you know they torture you all the time. And, you know, it, 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 I'll never get used to this. You know, I've been going through it for almost seven years. I will never get used to this. I will never understand these people. I don't understand how somebody can sit there. And not move. I think they're looking at a monitor and watching you sleep and torture you in your sleep. They tortured me in my sleep all morning. From 8 o'clock in the morning until I got up around 1. You know? They tortured me. What is that? 9, 10, 11, 12, you know, 5 hours. And then. I thought, well, I'll get up. Maybe it'll stop. It didn't stop. You know, they were hitting me off and on. Um, if I'd make something to eat and all this stuff, they can make my stomach upset. 
to where I feel like I'm going to throw up. I threw up three times this morning because of them. You know, it's total artificial, you know, synthetic, whatever you want to call it. It was them. Because they'd leave me alone for a little bit, and then I, I felt normal. You know, and then they would make my stomach upset. So if I'd grab a cup of coffee or something to eat or whatever, they'd make my stomach stomach upset to where I didn't have an appetite. You know, I felt like thrown up. You know, it was just miserable today. You know, these people get off on this. They they enjoy watching you in misery. I don't understand it. I will never understand that. I will never understand it. I don't care, um, you know, if somebody could explain, you know, a psychopath mind or sociopath mind, um, you know, maybe I'd understand it a little bit, but I, I, I just, I don't understand how somebody can sit there and torture somebody, an innocent person, for hours and hours and hours every single day. I go through this every morning. You know, I wake up, feed the dogs, try going back to bed, and I'm laying there, and I'm being remote near monitored, remote near manipulated. They're doing behaviorals in my sleep. They hit me a little bit with rage when I'm sleeping. You know, and a little bit of these, oh, I don't know, it, it's, it's hard to describe. Uh, they got some frequencies that are really hard to describe. You feel all weird, you know, like it's going through your whole body and all this stuff, you know. It's very uncomfortable. I will never understand how um, somebody can sit here and torture an innocent guy every single day. I just, I will never understand that. I just don't get it. I don't get it. You know, I like to see people, you know, I mean, I get down on people. You know, that's my bad. But, for the most part, I like to see people happy, strong. You know, like, you're not going to do this to me anymore. Knock it off. You know, I like that kind of attitude. That's my attitude. You know, um, you know, I have that attitude. I have to, to survive. I got to survive. You know, I'm sick of being a victim. I'm sick of these guys torturing me every single day. I'm sick of it. I'm tired of it, you know. I'm going through this every single day, seven days a week, for hours and hours and hours on end, you know. And you got some psycho sitting there for hours torturing you. You know, I'm sick of it. I'm tired of it, you know. So, you know, you know, I do things to, you know, I write to people and I do things to try to stop, you know, try to stop my targeting, you know. Like I say, it, it just stopped there for a couple of weeks. Now it's like they're starting to hit me again. Are they going to hit me tomorrow? I don't know. They got me pretty good today. All day, 12 hours. You know, 8 in the morning until 8 at night. So are they going to do it tomorrow? I don't know. You know, they get, they seem to get more and more and more abusive as the days and the hours go on. So, you know, you know we'll have to see what happens tomorrow. But uh, anyway, I'm going to cut this off, you know. Um, I hope you guys have plans. I hope you're trying to break this stuff up somehow. Barbecuing, getting together with friends, um, you know, going for bike rides or walks or, or whatever to enjoy nature, you know, um, and all that stuff. I hope you guys have plans to do things to break this crap up, you know, really, um, and stuff. So... Um, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm going to try to go camping a couple times. I'm going to smoke some food and try to enjoy myself a little bit here and there and break this crap up a little bit. So, anyway, I'm going to cut this off. Um, so I just thought I would do a little video, you know, tell you, give you guys an update or whatever. And, um, I hope you guys are doing well and I'll, I'll talk to you guys later.